Well, hi right, folks, I'm just going to show you just a dead simple technique of chattering, which is where you put a, you don't have to put any coloured slips on, but it, it does show up better. If you put a coloured slip on and use a chattering tool and it just chatters and cuts through little bits back through to the clay body. So first of all, I'll just put my, uh, my coloured slip on, which I'm going to be cutting through. The most important thing is you need to pop the clay to be quite hard when you're doing this. So then the tool actually bounces about and does and does the actual chattering like I say. So I'll put a bit of just a little bit of colour on. And then you let this dry again. Maybe ten minutes, just until it's just until it's hard again. So I'll come back and I'll show you the chattering in a minute. Right, it's dried out now. I'll just show you the tool. It's just a bit of flat metal plate, really, and you just place that on when it's spinning round, and let it bounce along. Put a bit of pressure on and let it bounce along. You'll hear the you'll hear the noise when it's working anyway. So we'll give it a go. So like I say, I'm just going to place this on now, and it should make a funny noise. Here it bouncing around, take a little chips of clay out, and now you won't see it until I stop. It should get quite a nice effect, and it's dead easy. So I'll turn it off and just show you what it looks like. I'll just take the camera off actually because you can't really see it. So that's the sort of effect you get, folks, from chattering. It takes random little chips of of the colour out back to the body of the clay or like I say you don't even need to put any colour on you can just use it as a textural thing but it does really give a nice a really nice effect and it's so easy to do so that's just a quick tip video block folks uh, using a chattering tool to get a nice effect on your pots